so cancer so when I was getting your energy there's some type of misalignment or something um, for some reason the color red was very significant to your energy at this time I'm not sure if you're angry upset or if there is someone around you or in your energy or the last time you seen a person that had on the color red or I'm not sure what the red is about but I'm also getting like um like some type of artistry poem doodling or something and someone loves to to kind of run and play run and play I was getting that as well but um someone needs to be more aware um i'm also getting generosity and some type of of spillage or something so let's go ahead and get into the tarot and see what is this misalignment beloved what is this misalignment for cancer why is the energy of this misalignment coming out for cancer please thank you so much beloved Thank you. So is someone doodling or being artistic or being creative or I'm not sure what the doodling is about, but let's see what's up. And and then the art card comes out. So let's see the message beloved has regarding this missile. That is too many cards, beloved. <laughs> uh, let's see. What else, beloved? Let's see how many cards we got out. So, Cancer, we have Fortitude. We have Valor. We have the Hangman. We have Peace. We have the Costume Designer. We have, wow, the Tower. We have Disappointment. We have Art. We have the Emperor, we have Justice, we have Gain. Let me get four more, beloved. Thank you. We have the Wool of Fortune, Gourmet Chef, Failure, and the Sun. The Misalignment. This tower, if someone, if someone or you, Cancer, don't get something in alignment, this tower moment is coming. And tower doesn't always mean like, oh, everything's going to come crashing down. This bad thing getting ready to happen. No, this tower could just be like um, a sudden epiphany, a wake up call or something like that. Because I feel like right now. There's something, Cancer, that you're not seeing. Maybe because there's some type of blockage or something. People are blocking you. You got people around you that... Oh, wow. You got people around you. They are gonna do their best to down you. Keep them squares up out your circle. So, you got people around you that's not for you, Cancer. But they parade around like they are all for you. But as long as you're in this energy... And you're not moving forward and leaving them behind or you're taking care of them or whatever the situation may be they're they're fine with that because remember that word generosity was there and look what's happening with this hangman as this hangman is sitting in that situation they're losing valuable resources finances connections with this phone being there they're using credit cards you know so um personal finances they're losing a whole lot of pinnacles so you know there's people around you that like that you're you're like in the stagnant energy that you're missed in line as long as you as long as you can't see the sun and you're blocked from it then you you don't have this open path and this is what these people are happy about that you are like stuck with them even though you really do have like like a great intuition like you could bring anything into fruition you're very creative um, talented, artistic, all those type of things. Like whatever you put your mind to, you could bring into fruition. But the problem is you have these damn people around you that don't want to see you doing better. Okay. But 
you know, you're giving so much to them, Cancer, but you feel like this about yourself, like you're disappointing yourself because you know all that you could be and all that you could do and stuff like that. Like, I feel like you, you like give too much of yourself and then resent it. I'm not even sure if you resent these, t these people or whatnot, but you know what I love about you, Cancer? That you're this type of person where you'll take this uh, tower and you'll come out the empress. I mean, the emperor. For me to say empress, you could come out the empress as well. But um, you come out in this emperor energy, like, you know, in a position of power, fortitude, because your intuition leads and guides you. As long as these people feel like you're in this energy and not in this energy, Cancer, they're going to continue to, like, take advantage, take your kindness for weakness or something like that. You don't need these people. You are financially, spiritually, emotionally abundant without them. If you are the type of person that feel like you need people instead of want people in your life is definitely time to do some deep soul searching because I'm telling you whatever you put your mind to will be successful with this will of fortune and this king of pentacles coming right um after it whatever you put your mind to will be successful i feel like this is what they fear because look how your towers turn out cancer okay Look how your towers turn out. You end up in your power and the will turns in your favor, right? And I wonder if you know this about yourself, like how victorious you are, Cancer. But maybe you can't see it. Maybe this is all you see. Because remember, you can't see this as long as you're around those people. I'm just saying, Cancer... So let's see what else beloved wants you to know, Cancer. What else does what else do you want Cancer to know, beloved? Because yeah, Cancer, you don't for that tower, for you to turn that tower into power, <laughs> only a cancer can turn a tower into a power. Because that's you know, with with the water signs being very intuitive, like you know what's up. You know what's up. Follow your intuition. Use your power, Cancer. Don't let them people like hold you back. Mm. But let's see. What else does Cancer need to know, please? What else? Get into alignment. And that's what that misalignment energy is. You're not using your power. What else does Cancer need to know, please? Hmm. What else does Cancer need to know, please? Wow. Cancer. You know, you know exactly what it is. It's this person, Cancer, that you hold on to this dream about. And you guys know I'm getting ready to sing this. Okay? When I first saw you... I said, oh my, that's my dream, that's my dream, I needed a dream to make me strong. You know, Cancer, what I'm wondering, if, if this dream you had was your tower, if it did awaken you to realign you and get you out of this energy, this is the energy that these these people have you in the schizophrenic energy being unsure of, of which way to go of where to stand of, or how to stand in your power right it's like um why do i feel like you have everything that you want but there's a piece missing and you can't seem to figure out why is this missing piece that doesn't seem to fit in your puzzle i don't know if this if it's a person or a situation but this missing piece feels like a person and this person doesn't fit into this puzzle because I feel like you and this person are supposed to build a whole nother puzzle or something together. Now is the time, okay, because you need to see whatever the situation is from a different point of view instead of the way you are seeing it. Because the will of fortune, this will of change is here. It's all about cancer, whether or not you want it, okay? You might, you might have, uh, um, um, wow, here come the brain fart. You might have plenty of options 
to choose from on which direction you want to go a cancer you're being advised to choose wisely okay but um other than that let's go ahead and get you a message from beloved close out the reading beloved what does cancer need to know please what does cancer need to know what does cancer need to know please one card please Ooh, cancer i don't know how i knew this was gonna come out self-love and everything changes let's do self-love first so self-love today i love myself fully I sell myself exactly as I am. I am able to recognize my own divinity and to appreciate the purity of my soul. I take the time to care for myself. I enjoy myself. I nourish myself. I am kind to myself. I am grateful for who I am. You know, stop putting everybody else before yourself, Cancer. This is the misalignment. You are love, right? Like you're a water sign. You're naturally love, right? So, why is self-love coming out for you when you are love? Ponder that for a moment. Let's see here. Everything changes. A soft light radiates from my heart. It illuminates those around me and transforms every situation I encounter. I maintain a positive attitude in spite of any difficulties I may perceive. No matter the circumstances, I remain a source of true joy. Everything changes when it is bathed in the light of the divine. Amen and amen to that. Everything changes when it was bathed, illuminated, realigned <laughs> in the light of the divine. Okay, Cancer. So that's the message I have for you, beloved. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching Black Madonna HP's Table Etiquettes. Please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the description box down below. I do offer personal readings, tarot card, tarot card creations. And I also have things available on my store tab. So definitely check that out for your different astrology, t-shirts, and all that type of stuff, sweaters. Really cute stuff. But either way, thank you so much for watching. Until next time love, peace, and so take care.